What we're going to do go is over climbing sweep from Daily Heva, but also going to do a cover a counter that they do and then a counter to a counter. So basically, let's cover the position real quick. So here's my Daily Heva hook covering his leg. This hand is going to go to his ankle. This is my distance foot, and I want to control this sleeve. Okay? So if he's got good posture, his knee's going to be point, pointing out because that's going to block my climbing sweep. But it's easy for me to counter that by just pressing with my distance foot, straighten his knee back up. That's going to allow me to climb and get through. Okay? So in essence, right here is the climbing sweep. When I get my foot all the way across, he can no longer step forward. So if I pull him forward, he's just going to fall, right? So um, that's the climbing sweep in essence, but we're covering the counter. So what happens a lot of times, when I come up here, I've got a back step immediately, right? Step back a little bit there. So here, guys, if he steps this far, I can take his back. We can do all that. But a lot of times what guys do, if they don't step back here, they'll kind of fall to his side and attack my foot or try to pass guard. Just come back around, John. So we don't want that. <laughs> Especially with all the leg locks people are doing now. Like I said, a lot of people just back step, fall down. But for the sake of the video, we don't need to do that. So the counter to that, knowing that there's really only one thing he can do when I, when I climbing sweep, is go backwards, is as soon as I come up, get my foot in, then I'll take this foot and cover here. So now I've got him covered on both sides. He can no longer back step, because I'm countering here. I can still sweep him, but it's easier to let go of the ankle, cover to this position. Now I just lift him up and I can sweep on either side. So, come here, and work on the other direction and finish. Simple up. All right.